Hello. It freezes every time I pause it. Welcome to the end of an era. It's, it's time. <laughs> Hopefully it's time. Uh, is the- which one's closer? I guess the, the manual save is closer. When does- when does my local Dollar Tree close? <laughs> I have to check this. This is viciously important. 9 p.m.? Alright, brothers. We got about three and a half, four hours max to beat this game. We're gonna do it! Welcome to the finale of AI of the Somnium Files. Date, where are you hiding? I can I on I promise you, I forgot what happened in the last one, and then as soon as this loaded up, Date. I was like, oh yeah, we're dead. I like viciously didn't remember what happened in the last stream. Hmm? There's color over there. Cool. I think the frame rate doesn't like the monochrome. Alright, the soup is middle lock one. His work is middle lock two. His funky jams are middle lock three. I think the rest of the house is middle lock four. That's like a, that's the wall, I think. And we are mental lock six. Bring back Date's heart. Date's heart is lost. To bring him back, I need to tell him my true feelings. Oh, I mean, that should be easy. This better not, this better, like, it better be that you're a family, right? Like, it better be. Memories of Stu. We're just gonna, like, recreate all the times he was, like, That's nice to Stu? us and stuff. Like, we're just gonna show all the bonding moments. This is the lore dump. Uh, I definitely think taste is the way to go. But it could be some. any of the three, to be honest with you. It's crazy that this, like, isn't the last Somnium of the game. The vegetables and meat are cut too big. Wow, he sucks at making stew. Big? How do you guys feel about stew? I'm not a fan of it. I'm not a Me? big stew guy. Why? I don't really like fluids in my food. That's a weird way to phrase it. Hey, Date! Everyone's waiting for you! Sorry, that's Ghost hey, Date. He can't hear you. Are you listening? It's a shade of Date. Date. Shadate. I think we did it. Don't be modest now. This is my special recipe. Eat it while it's hot. But it's like the coffee from Digimon Cyber Sleuth, and it sucks. I don't know how I did it. Put like it mayo in it. Pretty good. I actually thought the Star Spangled Banner was fucking playing in the background for a second there. Oh, fine, I'm hungry. Haha, <laughs> the stuff's cut too big. This sucks. Imagine if we had that, like, long-ass cutscene and that wasn't the solution. Imagine if, like, we were just wrong, but we still had to sit through, like, the five-minute cutscene. Cool, we made a stew. Hell yeah, brother. This is when I first came to Date's house. Oh, okay. Date, what happened? Why this? Dude, I still don't- we still don't know who, like, the original Cyclops killer is. It's not, like, Rodan or whatever his fucking name was, right? Oh, fuck. This is a hard one. Shit, this is tough. Date's corkboard. I wanted to hit computer, but maybe this is a sign. <sighs> hit me with this note. I wonder what this note is. Although this picture having a skull tempted me into picking Side? it. Side? Wop? This is clearly the wrong choice. Is this someone's name? A woman? I can't tell. Ugh. Useless. Date's Damn. handwriting is trash. Maybe both of them are good info for us. Date's... I mean with this picture? A pretty picture of a river. Where is Akikawa Valley? I'd like to go there someday. In the afterlife. Fuck me. Date's I should've computer. just used the computer. Oof! That's the- that's a loud fucking vehicle. What's with the ID? Date's police- Fuck me. Date's computer. 
We're about to lose, I think. Power button, power button. Where is it? Well. Ha! Oh. Oh. Whoops. That's I'm not the option I chose, though. Dante! I didn't choose hit it. I broke your computer. You can't watch any more porn. This is a good attempt. You better come out and stop me. Is it too late to restart? Date's police. Hold it up. Just, just give me the, just give me all the skulls. Respect the badge. Yup. Just testing what would happen. Not playing around or anything. Date's police. Four minutes, Mizuki. Fuck. Are you all right? No, I'm very not all right. Date's police ID. Mizuki's like a Without mountain. Without this, no one would believe he's really a police officer. Yeah, Leaving this... it around like this is how it gets lost. If I hide it somewhere, maybe he'll panic and wake up. Uh, never mind. This is, is this the mountain Mako like was talking about as the worst Somnium? Are you fucking me? Date's computer. I have no fucking idea. Do I have to hit it? Hold up. How do I get this thing working? Uh oh, it's smoking. Uh, maybe it's busted? Better hit it some more. Date, I'm beating up your computer. I can't Why? control myself. That was an awkward cut. Hurry, come stop me. Um, am I missing something? So like, actually, I've picked every option but the right one then. Date's computer. I think throwing it is a bad Dante's idea. Date's police. But you know what? It's Dante's better computer. than spending an extra time to throw the ID. Ha! They didn't even break the window. This is all your fault, Date. Get up already. Did we actually pick every option you before the correct away. one? Be careful. That's actually fucking Dante's insane. Mostly because this makes no Dante, fucking sense to do. Get up. Are you crazy? Jeez, what are you doing? It's because you washed your old underwear with my clothes, dummy! Pervert! I gotta be more careful. If I keep this up, I'm not gonna get off with a warning and a pay cut. It didn't even have glass. I'm sorry, did she throw his police ID? I remember this. Out a window because he mixed the laundry? Dude, listen, we're fucked. So we might as well figure out as many of the answers as we can. Hit me with a look closer. Oh, maybe this. We'll have to speed run this shit when we do our second roundabout. Hey, your school announced bring your parents to school day, right? Don't you have to tell Renju and Shoko? No, dare not be penguins. Wouldn't matter. What should I do? Sorry for making you worry about me, Date. I feel like we don't talk about, you know, how fucked it is. That, like, he legit just had to take care of this kid. Her fucking parents were like, hey, cop. I get that they were best friends, but hey, cop. Dude, take care of my fucking child during the, like, most volatile point of her life. Good luck. I'm definitely looking the inside the audio missing. speaker. Ooh, it's a tough one. It's a toughie. Our flag was still there. Hmm, that's my voice. I kind of can't believe Mizuki. that worked. Mizuki, hold on. I'll find you. Yeah, one was abusive and the other was negligent. Yeah, man, I'm not saying she wasn't better off with Date. She clearly was. I'm talking about, like, <laughs> from Date's perspective, it's real fuck that he just had, like, a kid unloaded on him. <laughs> like, he's super good for taking care of her and stuff. But, like... We focus on, like, the, the child abuse, because the child abuse is super bad. But, like, they, it's weird that they're, like, they didn't, like, put her up for adoption or anything. They're, like, <laughs> give it to your fucking cop rabbit. friend. Oh, fuck, dude. I want to call it ugly, because that seems like it's the right answer. 
but give it a hug. <laughs> I love my Atta Rabbit. It feels so warm and comfy holding it. Calling it ugly is such a... How did you know that I would like it, Dante? Okay, yeah, you have to call it ugly, because that's such a specific option. It's Atta Rabbit. That it has to trigger... It's probably like her first reaction to it or something. Atta Rabbit is... Kind of ugly. I mean, at the time I said it was ugly, but... Hmm. I hope this is okay. What if she doesn't like it? I'm home! I kind of like that we did the hug first, because now it adds to it with the whole, how did you know I would Zuki, like this? Uh, welcome back. What are you hiding? Porn. What is this face? What's that? Oh, he was still missing an eye at this point, but didn't get this? the robot? Never mind. Oh, uh, I'm, I'm no, he under... definitely still has eye because his pupils are different. I thought he was just walking around with a missing eye because he didn't have Iba yet. Dude, is this the timeline where he lost all of his memories until six years ago? I don't remember. Looks awfully empty, right? Look, it's perfect right here. Hmm, ugly. Listen, there might be we we might be able to save this. It's extremely unlikely, but. Oh, especially because that gave us a fucking skull. <laughs> Never mind, we're definitely not saving this. Next is... I think it's the bed. It's my bed. <sighs> Listen, the only strat here is to do smell, just to burn the skull. Doesn't smell like anything. Good. That's the that's the pro I can't gamer sleep strat. If it smells like Date. You shouldn't be sleeping it's in my this bed. bed. You okay. have less than two minutes. Hurry, uh, Mizuki. No. Uh. Try to sleep in it. <sighs> I don't think lifting Sorry, the bed Sorry, Date, will do anything. but I can't sleep anywhere but here. <sighs> Figuring out a dream is tough. What should I do next? Why is there even a skull Oto would have to make the game seconds. harder? What? Oh, because Oda's no, good at shitty puzzle it. games. Didn't I used to sleep on that sofa? Yeah. Did we just when unlock did that sofa? Change? What a relevant bit of info that somehow didn't progress anything. A door. Do tackle for sure. This door must be extra tough to take one of my tackles. Maybe I should train with it. Okay, it's not what I thought tackle was gonna do. A door. There we go. Listen, we're gonna blow through this. We're gonna get right to the end and then run out of time. Mizuki, hey. I'm sorry about eating your pudding without asking. Is that music? I'll buy you another I thought one. that was the outside of the house. Did she lock herself hey, come out. Come on, open up. I'm at my limit here. I really have to go. Oh, it's the I'm bathroom. Piss okay. my pants. Mizuki, seriously, come on. Open the door. Funny meme. Knocking sound effect. Sound on the soundboard that. Okay. Date's bed. You know what? At least they gave me a hint that, like, what I need to do is sleep here. We've at least gotten some knowledge. I was sleeping here before, though. Just kidding. Uh. Wait, never mind. I was about to take the game's credit Mom. away, but it hurt me. Daddy. I said that? She said that like she was one of those fucking Furbies that talks to you. That was very robotic. <laughs> she sleeps like Dunks does. She looks crippled. Jeez.
It vaguely sounds like the Star Spangled Banner. There's color that way now. It looks like sunlight. Dude, it's crazy that like we definitely could have done this. One minute. You have to hurry. If I didn't pick every fucking option wrong. Date's coat. <sighs> Very specific option. This looks dirty. It smells like him too. Well, I'm not gonna wear it. I don't want to wear your coat, Date. Why would that be an option? What a strange fucking choice. It's the fridge. What? I'm like wasting seconds walking back and forth. Don't taste. Don't smell or kick. It's one of these two. I'm gonna go open. But get in might be the option. Huh. Nothing's inside. Probably because this is Date's dream. It's the frick. Give me the two seconds instead of the one. We can save that one sixth for something bigger if necessary. I don't do good with tight spaces. And it's cold. I can't believe this. What the fuck do you want me to do? That tastes kick. No, it's not right. Fuck. I'll do it when he's wearing it. That's much better. Oh my god, that was it actually. Hey, I got an extra sweet pudding for little babies. You can have it. I thought she kicked him square in the nuts from behind. Watch your mouth! Nice kick. Kicked his eye right out of his socket. Oh no, there's like multiple puzzles we have to solve here. There's no fucking way. My school bag. It's the charm. I mean like, obviously it's the charm. This is from Mikume Shrine. We went there in a different timeline, except it wasn't me, it was Aset. Wait, also we went here. Hey, in multiple since we're timelines. Here, let's go into the shrine. I told you, I don't believe in that stuff. Come on, come on! Wait, this happened in real life. We were there for this. <laughs> yeah, wasn't this right before she got kidnapped or something? This was right before the mad shootout. Come on, let that be the last one. Send me home. I wish that the Zuki grows up healthy and happy. Whoa! You weren't supposed to hear that. What did you ask for? To leave this boring place as soon as possible. Date. Damn, it's so sad. Rest in peace. Oh, <gasps> did we do it? Bro! The comeback of the century! Date! Daddy! Mom! Yo, are we gonna have to choose? Bro, we have- do we have to choose? Oh shit, we have to- we have to fucking choose. Oh god, we only have 30 seconds to choose. Alright, see you, you fucking losers. You absolute fucking dork wads. Date? Date, wake up! Everyone is worried about you! You shouldn't come to me. Go be with your parents. What? We have to go tell him to Mizuki, fucking you're out of time. eat my fucking shit. The final gambit. Fuck. Daddy. 
the mom Listen, was abusive. I'm sorry that I couldn't spend that much time with you. From now on, I promise to play a lot more with you. Daddy? Daddy! The end. Yeah, okay. Listen, start me out from the fucking beginning. We're gonna speed through this. We got. We can't like fail every one of those other options. So how are how are you doing? How's how's your day going? Is that you doing all right? I'm doing pretty. Uh, I'm doing pretty solid. I've been doing. I've been doing just fine. Uh. I have nothing, absolutely nothing has happened today. <laughs> Went to work. I, uh, waited an hour and a half for someone to get me some freaking gotcha. food. Bad because of this? You know what? That's completely understandable. What a completely reasonable reaction. I At least we can super speed this. Look how fucking fast this goes. Obviously, I'm speeding up all the dialogue, but it's just, it's real speedy. A speaker. Yeah, I don't need a, to use fucking time for that one. You have five minutes it's remaining, a... Mizuki. Uh, this one and call it ugly. How much does it cost to knock? A door. It costs a lot to knock. So I think the big brain play it's my... is to do smell to burn the skull. Because then we burn 12 seconds, but it saves us a lot more. Then we sleep on the sofa. That was a lot of fucking unlock noises. Four minutes, Mizuki. Oh shit, four right? minutes, Mizuki. Are you alright? Now watch me go pick the mom, and it's like, hey, dumbass, you weren't supposed to pick either of them. It's probably gonna be some shit, like I gotta pick Date, and then I gotta pick Date again. I gotta, like, keep picking Date. And I'll fucking do it too. I got the time to spare now. Date. Date, wake up. I should have uh, I should have used my my time Date. to do it again, bitch. Date, please wake up. I am not what you need. No, absolutely not. <laughs> I reject. Hey! You have three minutes remaining. I reject the Dante! parents. It has to be you, Dante. Thank if, God they didn't make me go to the parents. If you were here, I'd... get up, Dante. <laughs> Dante, all our time. I... Dante, please. I only have three minutes. <laughs> Mizuki. You know, he pulls like a gotcha nose. Why does he have Thank you, here? Mizuki. I didn't go, uh, talk to the mom because the mom's dead, so it doesn't matter. Uh, also, I don't remember if this is the timeline where Rinju is dead, so. <laughs> I've lost track of when Rinju is alive and dead. I think this is the timeline where Rinju is missing. Dude, we got Captain. Bonds revealed. Yeah. 
So anyway, that wasn't the end of the game. <laughs> Somehow. What the? How did I? Wait, wasn't there like some big dramatic thing about her using the Somnium thing? Like, wasn't she gonna lose an eye or something? Hey, why the sudden affection? I feel like that was implied. Because if you so use stupid. the machine, something. Huh? And she's like, you're "I'll so do it, stupid. whatever it I takes." Just gonna punch you. And then like everything's just fine. Welcome back. Is Tessa dead in this timeline, or is she, like, in the hospital? <laughs> like, what, what, what's happening in this storyline? Yeah. I'm home. I get that the congressman... Is, de is he dead? Did we kill him? Or did he get arrested? I think we killed him. Are the credits about to roll? Imagine, like, imagine you never get, like, interrupted, right? Imagine you just, like, play through. I, I imagine, I actually, I imagine this can't happen. I imagine it interrupts you at some point. I think Mako said no matter what, you're guaranteed to get interrupted before you get, like, an actual ending. But, like, imagine you somehow get to this and, like, you're never interrupted and you just think that's the fucking ending. And you're like, what was the point? <laughs> Can I skip this? Okay, yeah, I can. What endings have we gotten where the credits rolled? It's, a uh, Aset fucking dies and time travel is real. Uh, Oda and his mom make up and we're a family. Are those the three endings so far? Credits will end and it reveals the killer is still alive. If the credits are gonna end they're like, wait, isn't there, like, a ton of shit still unwrapped? Okay, listen, listen to me, listen to me. I didn't see Ayaba right here on her shoulder, so when it said Date watched by Ayaba, I was like, what the fuck is this twist? Okay. Let's talk to Ayaba. I thought there was some weird fucking psycho twist going on. It is more comfortable than your eye socket. I, but I haven't. You can played. sit here anytime you want, okay? Just hide if you see someone coming. The world's not ready for you. Yeah, about the serial killings, also. The case has been settled. No. So Sejima was confirmed to be the new Cyclops <laughs> killer. What? No crimes similar to the MO of the Cyclops killer have been reported since So Sejima died. How long has it been? Like six hours? But we still don't know his motive. Yeah. Why were those three chosen as targets? And why hollow out the left eye? Yeah. <laughs> it is the opinion of also, the lead investigators the that killer. that behavior was simply the result of So's sadistic, what? sociopathic nature. Is So actually like the killer it. in all timelines now? Oh. Sorry, Mizuki. No, it's fine. Who was the third victim in this timeline? I do not believe in the existence of God, but being that we are at a shrine, I felt it necessary to go with the tradition. What did you pray for, Date? He can't. I didn't be. ask for anything. I just said thank you. Thank you for saving my life. Pardon me. I believe there is a misunderstanding. Yeah, you're supposed to be talking to God, not Mizuki. It was I who saved your life, not God. I was the one who stopped oh. the bullet. <laughs> she took it as him that talking was completely to by chance. God. I was talking to fucking music. Wait, do you even remember that? I do. Everything that I see is uploaded to the cloud, all wirelessly, in real time. That's pretty cool. Even if my body it's is pretty totally convenient. destroyed, my data is backed up and never lost. My my, my mic isn't like cutting out or anything, is that it? That includes my memories. The audio levels well are looking a little janky. Which governs my artificial intelligence. Though, I do not have any information from after being shot. 
Yeah, because you were freaking dead. Do you know what Date said right before he lost consciousness? No. Uh -oh. What did he say? I said, Mizuki, I'm so glad that you're he said, safe. said, Iva got a fat ass. No, you didn't. You were moaning about wanting to go to a cabaret club. No, it's good? Okay, that cool. Thank you. That sounds like Date. Hey, Iba, now that you're in that form, <gasps> think you can wiggle your way into that offering box? Certainly. I go to the money box, you go to jail. Is that acceptable? I guess not. Damn, he really can't commit, like, any crimes. Yeah, about these two. Oto was discharged from the hospital. He's doing fine. That sucks. Iris is still in the hospital, though. Okay. I heard. I hope she gets better soon. Yeah. What was her deal? Like, what happened to her? Was she, like, she missed an eye, but she's still alive or something? I legit just don't that remember. That you die soon so that I can collect your life insurance money? You think I have life you insurance? You wouldn't get a dime. <laughs> yeah, about the guy There's who one definitely... one thing I told you yet, Date. I'm so Tsujima. Five days after the first incident, on Tuesday, I think, I saw So on my way home from the police station. It's pretty big info. Where? I was getting dropped off at home. But that's at the exact moment that the third murder was happening. Is he alone? No. Someone was walking next <gasps> to him. How the fuck do you not remember anything from last time? I just, listen, I'm not gonna remember anything from this My time homeroom either. Teacher. Homeroom teacher. Oh, fuck right, Iris's mom. We have that She's ending. also my mom's best friend. That's right. Listen, long story. I'll tell you later. that what she just said makes sense, but my brain registered it as she was supposed to say my best friend's mom. No, tell and it me was now. backwards, but... I don't want to. Right. Excuse me. Why not? <laughs> because I'm hungry. I'll tell I'm you over hungry. food. I'll tell you when you jump to another timeline. <laughs> All right. That's go. her being like, hey, here's the oh, timeline you should go to next. You haven't said it yet said what thank you for saving your life <laughs> i don't recall hearing a thank you from you either i saved your life before too you know damn well, fine it's got me you don't have to say it i know that you love me who said anything about loving you oh you don't remember when we were at so's you were saying mizuki mizuki you sounded really concerned i wasn't saying mizuki i was saying my new skis yeah, I was thinking about They're hitting late. the slopes later. Nice cover. Date, you're a total tsundere. A tsundere. One who appears cold okay, or hostile Okay, the definition initially, wasn't necessary. But eventually shows a warm or friendly side. That describes Date perfectly. That describes Mizuki more than Date. I don't want to hear it coming from you two. What? What do you mean? They really don't see it, huh? Okay, at least he said it. Can I leave? Can Doesn't I matter. go home? Let's get going. Oh, yo, his head turns. That's a neat touch. Where? You know. <laughs> you know. We're gonna go eat that vomit stew. Really? And then, like, a little fucking goblin man runs out behind them, and they're like, Oh, shit! And that unlocks a secret timeline. I get that they do these. It took 20 hours for a neat touch. <laughs> oh, brother. I think we've been here more than 20 hours. I get that they do that so that you're like, oh, this is the timeline I have to go to next. But I really feel like, oh. Oh my god, it's almost time. That's, that's one of the only two, right? That's this one, and then... Like, this was an ending? Yeah, okay, so that was that, was that ending. And this is the fucking boss was the Mafia member. We're so close. We're at the fucking end. Is, is this gonna form a shape or something? Because it doesn't look like it. I need like a recap. 
After sinking with Iris, Date couldn't bring himself to believe her apparent delusions. Even so, since she was still in danger, Date took Iris to Matsushita Diner. Date headed to the Seigon residence, leaving Iris and Oda in Mizuki's care. Hitome told Date that Iris has a brain tumor that will soon take her life. Iris' strange ideas were apparently the result of the tumor. Mizuki called Date in distress, claiming that Iris ran away. Looking for Iris, Date headed to the cold storage warehouse inside the warehouse. Date discovered Iris' frozen corpse. Okay, so this is the whole axolotl storyline, where she has a brain tumor. Date stared out over the water, overcome with guilt. Iba claimed that she could remove the dandelions growing in his head. What does that mean? I have no memory. Of her saying that. Okay, I at least, I kind of understand what timeline this was. I may not remember the specifics, but I, I, I recall this. What if, like, all of this is canon except for the part where people die and it's just hauled out of order? That doesn't make sense, which is why it might be true. How do you think the Miiverse guy would raid the water in this game? Have you settled down? The scene is being inspected without you. This time the body didn't disappear. However, you lost consciousness. I that didn't sucks. expect you to faint. Seeing that corpse must have been incredibly shocking. I did not predict you to be the fainting type. I Those estimate we have like two hours left. Hey, remember that prisoner escaping? Shit, was that this timeline? Now that you're back, let's get back to business. This was the Falco escapes timeline, right? And the other one was the Falco gives us you a bunch of information conscious, timeline. Are you, not? are you at a loss for words? Date, don't let negative thoughts consume you. Yeah, cuz this is the pewter helps. Thinking that I Falco escaped because of me. Timeline. If I never took her to Ota's, this wouldn't have happened. Call me true. If you truly believe that, then your brain is completely rotten. Or perhaps when you saw the corpse, your head became filled with images of blooming yellow dandelions. Oh, okay, this is the thing what? that oh, the case file now. said about. Was I correct? If you consider the situation logically, even an elementary school student would understand. Huh? Fine. Allow me to pluck some of those dandelions from your mind. I will ask three questions. Please answer honestly. Okay. First question. The cold storage warehouse was not in regular operation. Yes. But even so, the AC was on, and a minus 58 degree temperature was maintained. Uh, to fuck with Why the body, that? I think? Why does the warehouse have to be kept at freezing temperature? Uh, it's to preserve something. To preserve something? Yes. Let us move on to the next question. Second question. There was something strange about the corpse. Do you remember what that was? The eye is missing. It, she might have also been naked. It was completely frozen. It was missing its right eye. It was covered by a cloth. It was hidden in the engine compartment. I mean, two of these are pretty weird, but I'm going to say the eye. That is a unique factor, but there was something else. Something more... Okay, it being in the compartment, then. The culprit was afraid that the body would be discovered, so they hid it under the hood. But why there? The ocean is right here. If they really wanted to hide the body, they could have put weights on it and sunk it into the water. The killer was still here when we showed up? I do not know for certain that the culprit was attempting to dispose of the body. They were trying to preserve the there body. There's something more unusual. They were trying to keep the body for some reason. Covered by a cloth? What is unnatural about that? Okay, so no. Strange, the culprit no, the listen. Because they didn't want it to be found. Her body being frozen but then they cover is the less cloth. peculiar than that any of these other things. Except maybe being covered by a cloth. She's in a frozen warehouse. The body may not have been hidden by the culprit. And even if they were responsible, it is not Wait. uncommon that murderers feel a sudden urge of remorse or pity for their victims. Yeah, it's frozen. It's in a fucking frozen so warehouse. Of course the body's pity. frozen. That is a possibility. Also, she just kind of said, like, hey, someone else hid the body, and I feel like we're brushing over that. The temperature read negative 58. With Iris's weight... 
Just wondering, but how much do you weigh? You expect me to remember this game? Do you expect me to remember this? I see. 105, huh? 105 live. Should have taken about 18 hours to freeze solid. Was she dead the whole time? Wait a moment. Before you draw your conclusion, allow me to ask my final question. Does she have a twin? Question Clones? Three. Two days ago, Sunday night, you found a dead body in the cold storage warehouse. I did? But afterward, you visited the Sagan household and discovered that Iris was in fact still alive. Oh yeah, because this is the timeline where we went to the Somnium and we thought we saved her life. Why? Oh, fuck. Iris is actually dead? I see. I understand now. Maybe we're thinking about this all wrong. Iris isn't alive. She's dead. I saw the ghost of Iris. Okay, no. Mr. Date, it's time. I'm just gonna say this one because it's clearly what they want. You've got it. I don't have it. What the fuck? Is it a, a doppelganger? They aren't fucking doing this shit. Do do do. Do 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 do. Question mark at the end of all of these. What is she a robot? No, that's leave it. Is she she's the empty. Stomach is swollen slightly. Oh, pregnant. She appears to have been pregnant. What? What? How? Do not worry. The uterus does not contain a fetus. What? You mean after she was killed? No. The fetus was not present in her body when she was killed. What? She must have been killed after giving birth. What? Alright, that's way better than where I thought they were going. I thought they meant she wasn't pregnant until after she died and something was put in there. So I'm glad this is horrible. I don't I don't know what's happening, but I'm glad it's not going with what I was thinking. The distended stomach does not immediately shrink after birth. Is it like the Kenny from, like, if you've ever seen the Mysterian episode, was it Mysterian? The, like, the Coon episodes from South Park, where, like, they, like, summon Cthulhu, and it's revealed that every time Kenny dies, his mom just gives birth to him. Is this like this? And he, like, he, like, grows up in, like, a day. Is this like this, but she gives birth to herself? The uterus takes some time to return to its normal This size. is disgusting. This evidence makes one thing perfectly obvious. This corpse isn't Iris. <laughs> what? It's someone else. Which means... Iris is still alive. Wait, what? Not necessarily. She could be alive. Why is this definitely someone else? Yet. What are you talking about? Multiple stab wounds with a single-edged, sharp object to the victim's back. Judging by the size <laughs> and shape of the marks, the weapon was most likely a kitchen knife. This matches what you said on Sunday. Excuse me? What the so fuck this is happening? This is the body I saw then. Is there an estimated happened? time of death? Impossible to determine. Yeah, the cold. This body has been completely frozen for at least ten years. What the fuck? Ten years? She was killed more than ten years ago? Exactly. Has she just been here for ten years? Her identity is unknown. Her killer is also unknown. But there is one likely suspect. The original Cyclops killer? Let's consider the clues. The scene. Okiura Fishery Cold Storage Warehouse. Okay. Sunday night. We saw So here. Okay. And there is something else about So Sejima. He has a memory of killing a girl that looks exactly like it Iris. Is someone similar to Iris being stabbed repeatedly? Is it actually family? a girl that just looks like fucking Iris? Well, no, they can take DNA, but they haven't yet because they just found the body. They're still investigating. Right now, it's unknown. Are they saying that Sosujima murdered someone ten years ago who looks exactly like Iris? As horrible as this is to say, it also explains why whenever we saw flashes of the Cyclops killing us, Iris was there. But it wasn't Iris. It was this woman. That is highly likely. What we saw? 
was So's memory from more than ten years ago. Dog, what? I believe that is the case. Am I on crack and Renji, forgot to so? realize it this time? But we still do not know where Renju is. No, this is the timeline where Renju is missing. That means that we need to talk to So Sejima. Damn, this really fucking overshadows the whole our boss is a mafia leader twist. <laughs> Which is how this game ends, apparently. Dude, I'm so mad that that was the first timeline we got, because, like, I would love for this absolute crazy train to continue rolling with us going from this to the boss is like a mob was behind everything. I'm worried about her, but... Without any leads, we'd just be looking for a blindly. Wasn't the body removed beforehand? It was removed and then, like, put back, I guess? I don't fucking know. I should focus on my investigation now. We'll eventually lead me to Iris, I'm sure of it. With that in mind, I headed to So's mansion. I thought I told you never to show your face here again. Well, we found a body from like 10 years ago, and it's yours. I didn't come here for I mean, Shoko today. You put, it's I didn't someone come else's. here for Iris either. Instead, I'm here for a girl who looks like Iris. Did you kill her? Date, look. I knew it. <laughs> he hasn't even lied yet. You killed her, didn't you? I don't know what you're talking about. I've had enough of your shit, Congressman. You wanted to check on the body of the girl you killed. That's why you were at the cold storage warehouse two days ago. So he just checks on it every now and again? Makes sure it's still there? A garden stone. Is there a mermaid down here? Oh damn. Where is Renju Okiura? You know where he is, don't Sleep you? Sleep on what the fish You were at an Okiura fishery warehouse for a reason. There's definitely a connection between you two. And that's not all. Number 89 called your secretary. <laughs> Didn't last time the heat ray doesn't work on him? <laughs> Dunks is just staring at me. Oh, that was the a different same timeline. 89 that Renju escaped with. Now tell me, where is Renju? Suddenly, a gang of bodyguards stormed out of the mansion. In an instant, they surrounded me. <clears throat> We'd like to ask you to please leave. How much, how hard do you think it is for him to find the same bodyguard over and over? That guy's face zoomed up should be the thumbnail. Crunch, crunch, crunch. Oh, I guess we left. Damn it, so! There's nothing we can do. We did arrive without a warrant. We were technically trespassing. If he had called the police, we would be in a predicament. We would have been detained immediately. Who would look after Iris then? Yeah, but he wouldn't call the fucking police. What do you mean who would look after Iris? You She's missing. Your responsibility with Mizuki and Ota. Ugh. Calm down, Date. We still have our lead. I think you mean who lead. would find Iris? Before I explain, we need to discuss the corpse in the cold storage warehouse. Please get to the point. Let's give her a name. Because okay. she is frozen solid, we can call her All Ice or Alice. What do you think? It's fucking not the time to be Alice joking. And Iris. I believe it fits. That just sounds confusing. All right, Alice. What about her? Someone might be able to identify her. Who? DNA. Allow me to ask you three questions. Oh my god. Again with this? First question. You have seen this corpse more than twice. Three times, in fact. Okay. When was the first time? <sighs> Dog. What? I can't. This one? I don't know when the days took place. Saturday night when I sink to the abyss. Yes. In the Somnium world. We saw the frozen corpse of a girl. 
Okay. That makes sense. Question two. When was the second time you saw? Oh, okay. So Sejima's girlfriend. It's Alice. Now I know. That girl was probably Alice. Can we... Most likely, yes. They really ain't doing DNA. Stop fillering the game. So we have technically known Alice for three days. Okay, wow. One last thing. Really makes me care more about the her. Final question. In which Somnium did we see Alice? So Sejima's, but I have to blow my nose real quick, so give me a second. Okay. We're back. Alice wasn't who saw me. It was so Sujima's. Why is it Adrian all of them? We was... did see Alice in so Somnium. Okay, then yeah, I was right. Your answer is not incorrect. What the fuck are you talking about? However, I mean specifically Alice's frozen corpse. Oh. Whose brain were we sent to then? Oh, it was fucking uh, Iris. Why is A who is Adrian? Last night, you saw Alice's dead body in last night's sink. Dude, I legit, I honest to God don't remember. I have no idea what you're talking about. Me? Was he? I don't think it was Mizuki. Adrian! Rocky! Adrian! Rocky! But seriously, I am talking about the corpse. Well, that was a fucking mistake. My roommate. Mizuki Okiura. Exactly. You mentioned something about Mizuki Somnium. I know, Dunks. Kind of I know. But prophecies are nonsense. I legit don't remember this. Dreams I hate you. Yeah, me too, future. brother. They are made from the past. Therefore... Mizuki has seen Alice before. There is no other explanation. Dog, you could have just fucking said that. Aiba, where is Mizuki now? Where we went with Iris yesterday, the Kume Shrine. The Shrine? Why would she be there? Unknown. Because it's where she always she is. She's supposed to be looking for Iris. Okay, let's go. So, like, I'm currently looking for the reason why we had to have finished the other timeline before we did this one. There has to be, like, some necessary info that's required for us to have. She somehow seen the corpse and never said anything. Date. I can understand being traumatized, but if I did, I would have told you already. Right. We do need to like at least address that. Now, where's uh Oda? I she... think he's searching Akihabara right now. Oh, he's last time he checked it. in, he said he didn't have anything. She's not gonna know where Rinju is. Iris used to like this shrine. It's Mizuki's homeroom teacher. But how it ties in, I don't know. Yeah, I mean, obviously it's the fact that they're like, oh, we saw uh, Hitomi with Sosajima. But we could have gotten that info here. Like, why did we have to do that whole other timeline to she unlock told this? Me about all her memories here. We used to come here all the time. And the answer could just be there is no reason, but... You know those steps in the front? If I stop yeah, thinking critically, we all just go brain dead watching this. Like... What gluten free means and eyelash extensions and aerial yoga. Aerial yoga? And we would talk about all our problems together. Sometimes we would talk late into the night. So I thought that maybe she'd be here, but it looks like I was wrong. We're gonna find her in the final timeline. I think Iris is with Renju. With Daddy? Yeah. Her note mentioned her most trusted person. That's probably Renju. 
Maybe brain dead is better. Yeah. I remember that mermaid girl saying something like that. Both the state of being brain dead and also the Peter Jackson film Brain Dead are both better than this. What is happening? My eyes! He was looking oh. for Iris. Does that mean that Daddy is the one who called for Iris? Isn't Iris dead in the boss timeline? Do you th do you think I fucking know? Wasn't she dead in this timeline? Does it matter? It could be. So I need to know where he is. But I haven't been able to get a hold of him. Mizuki, I have something very important to ask you. But yes, I think she is dead in the boss timeline. Because I think that's the one where we show up into the live stream and like we didn't. I think her and Oda are dead in the boss timeline. You've seen her before, haven't you? Three days ago, I saw her in your Somnium. The body of a girl who looks like Iris, Alice. Your dreams are built from your memories. So that corpse... Mizuki, please, answer me. Iris's life is at stake. Why wouldn't they just call her, like, Jane Doe or something? As in, what huh? every fucking What do you does. mean? I told Mizuki everything. About how Renji ran off with the assassin number 89. How 89 is connected to Sosajima. Blat, 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 blat. And that Sosajima is linked to Alice's murder. I need to know everything about Alice. If I find out who she is, I might be able to solve the mystery of Renju and number 89. <laughs> Muzuki's like, okay, well, I found her fucking corpse in a frozen warehouse, and that's and that everything I know. To Iris. Mizuki looked down at her feet quick, quietly. I could see agony in her face. The silence lingered. Finally, she steeled herself, lifted her head, and spoke. Okay, I'll tell you about Alice. Cool. It was about a month ago. It was a fucking long time ago. I saw my ago. daddy crying in the president's office at Lemniscape. I was peeking through a crack in the door so he didn't see me. Daddy got up, then got into his car and drove away. Yeah. I had never seen him like that before. I was curious, so I followed him in a taxi. You got taxi that money? Went to the cold storage warehouse. He got out of his car and went inside. I followed right behind him, quietly. Daddy was standing next to the forklift in the back. I hid behind a shelf. I watched Daddy open the hood of the forklift, and then, after a little bit, he left. Fuck you, game. Fuck you. Do you think this is all gonna come down to So Sejima became the new Cyclops killer and killed everyone who knew about the body to keep his secret, and then he just imitated the Cyclops killings to try and throw people off. To know what he was looking at. And then we just never learn anything about the old Cyclops killings. I went over to the forklift and I looked under the Which to my knowledge we still don't know who did them unless it was Ro Rohan or whatever the fuck his name was, which I feel like was sober. Miski's been living with Date for four years and yeah, we'll never say anything. Okay, to be fair, this was one month ago, but she definitely should have said it within a month. I'm not saying she shouldn't have said something. I'm saying it's not like she's known it for four years. She, she, I, she, it's not that I can't believe she went four years without saying something. I can't believe she went a month without saying something. You saw Alice's dead body. But at the time, I thought it was Iris. And like, when you saw Iris, like a lot in that last month, you didn't like, think about it. Yeah, what did you do after that? The corpse looked exactly like Iris. Yeah. I couldn't believe she was dead. I just couldn't. So I went yeah. to Iris's house. Yeah. Huh? What's wrong, Mizuki? I mean, she knew that she could trust Date. I understand. But in, in that defense, I still, I want to make it very clear. She should have said something. She also probably thought she could trust her dad to not be hiding Iris a fucking alive. corpse. I thought I was going crazy or dreaming. I tried that's to kind of myself that it was just a hallucination. That's it. Actually, I kind of believe this. I kind of feel like if I found like 
the dead body of my friend and I ran to their house and they were like, hey, what's up? I'm good. I'd be like, fuck, dude. I need to, like, go to a doctor immediately. I might have a brain tumor. I actually think that's kind of what a realistic reaction. Now, she still should have said something, but Daddy then she would have been like... Trouble. So you kept quiet this whole time? Oh, she ain't no snitch. That's the issue. I need you to pick... I just got done defending you. I need you to pick a reason you didn't say anything. Was it because you didn't want your dad to get in trouble or because you thought you were crazy? What do you mean? No, you fucking won't. I couldn't just ask. It would have changed everything. I don't even know I what I just asked that. her, to be honest as long with you. As I stayed quiet, everything would be okay. Terrible thing I didn't to think. See a dead body. I wasn't even at the warehouse. I can no longer defend her. I repeated that to myself over and over and tried to forget the whole thing. Repressed memories are often the subject of somnia. That's why Alice showed up during the sink. About the warehouse. I actually met with one of the higher ups at Daddy's company last night. Yeah, before that's cool. I went to Matsushita Diner. Why? Because you asked about the cold storage. You I was fool. curious. I asked around some. Did she ask her I dad about it? I'm pretty sure she didn't say shit to anyone. Before I was born. After my grandpa died, Daddy took over. In exchange for managing the warehouse, he gave ownership of the company to Excuse someone else. Excuse me? I guess he didn't want to let this place go. Or maybe he couldn't let it go. That's more accurate, I think. But I understand why. Inside Next that warehouse a fucking corpse was... In there. A body. Alice. On paper... Daddy has nothing to do with Okiura Fishery. Oh, the question I asked was, did she ask your dad about it? Okay, Daddy my was bad. Still managing the warehouse, and he was the only one allowed in there too. Very loud person on the phone. That was part of the agreement when he gave up. If the they company. become audible, let me know. And the whole thing had to be a secret. Really they're not like them. as loud as they normally are, but they're being pretty loud right now. Hell, is that it? Oh, I gotta like say something to you. I guess there's more for us to do then. Hey, Mizuki, how long was he managing the warehouse? How long was he? I might need to. I'm gonna have to mute. Give me a second. Hello, I'm sorry for how long it took, but uh. I see the BRB, so whenever I know you're back, I'm good to go. I will simply wait. Dunks, you got a toy? Man, he got a little soccer ball. You crazy. Oh, excuse me. Apparently, Pokemon Go Community Day was today, but I care so little about Pokemon Go anymore. That I simply didn't realize it. Are we back? Yeah, let me blow my nose super quick and then we're good to go. Okay, if you start hearing the phone call from the other room again, let me know, but we should be quieter now. For 18 years. That's a lot of years. Has there been a body in there for all 18? That's what the man told me. 18 years? From that long ago? This dude's a snitch, by the way. Yes. Iba, I need an emergency search. I need to make sure. Don't mind me. My door is weird in that. If it's closed all the way, not much sound gets out. And you have to be super loud for sound to get in. But if it's even cracked a little, missing person sound, uh, sound goes to shit and you can hear everything. Understood. Huh? Date, I found her. Whoa. A girl who looks like Iris. She actually just looks like her. It's not like a disguise What's or anything. Name? Monica EY. 
19 years old at the time of her disappearance. What a coincidence. A graduate of a Toku high school. I like to think Sosujima thought that Iris was like a fucking ghost and what? snapped. Why is he surprised? Renju was my classmate at Eitoku High. Oh, okay. We've known each other for 20 years now. Uh-oh. When I was young, I... I lost someone very important to me. Oh. Okay. Nope. It's it's Iris's real mom. Hitomi isn't Iris's mom. Monica Iwai, my best friend. One of the only friends I had. Yeah, okay, Monica EY gives birth to Iris, uh, gets murdered, or something along those lines, gets murdered, gives birth, something, some, some, some order of that, Hitomi takes care of the kid. Alice's Monica. I don't know how the rest of this ties in. The same school as her and Renju, but why? That explains why they. Monka's body was found. Well, now. look similar, but really they look exactly the fucking then, same. But even back then, knew. Actually, the flashback of her doesn't look at all like the body. She knew that Monica was already dead. Iba, where is Hitomi right now? At headquarters for questioning. MPD still believes that the body they discovered was Iris. Oh, that's a good point. I didn't even pick up on. She commented on Monica being dead, but Monica is missing, so she knows about the murder. Okay. Got it. Contact boss. Have them bring his That's actually a good little slip of the tongue that I wouldn't have caught. That's like a dang and rompo, you just fucked up and now we know you're the murderer kind of shit. The question is, who was kill? My mouse is on the screen. Uh Oh yeah, is it evidence time? actual gameplay we've only done this two or three times the whole game let's saw go the corpse of your daughter today yeah you were called into the station to confirm her identity but i know it's not and my daughter you are cool as a cucumber even though you lost your precious daughter shall i guess why i am hiding my daughter from you how can hitomi stay calm uh what's the information on monica her name is EY Monica. She has been missing for 18 years. She okay. was 19 years old at the time she went missing. Okay. Monica, Hitomi Sagan, and Renju Ok. Okay. Where's the one where Monica's body She mentions dead. that she knows Her Monica right is dead. Missing. Her body shows multiple okay. cause of death was those. The murder yeah. weapon was most We we know this info, so she I can just skip also it. Pregnant. All right. I think it's just the information on Monica, but I want to make sure. Monica's Actually, never mind. This doesn't matter in the slightest. I shouldn't have clicked this one. Because Monica's corpse is completely frozen, however, her appearance thus, it is extreme. So her baby would be just turning 18. Whoa. I think it's this. Because that body isn't Iris, and you know it. Are you serious? Yes. Her name is Monica Ewai. She was killed when she was 19. She went to the same high school as you, and she was your best friend. I feel like this storyline, right? like, solidifies it for me, that if you picked one of these timelines... Nothing to say for yourself? ...and just made a full game about it that was maybe 10 hours, 10, 15, 15 max, I, like, would probably be interested in care. Because even this, which is by far, like, one of, if not the worst of the stories, at least it's insane enough that I'm like, what the fuck is happening? But, like, they ruined it Maybe by making me dawdle for 20 hours. That's and now we're dumping all of the interesting parts at the very end, oh, good or bad. Now you're talking. But we know Renju committed a crime, illegally disposing of a body. And we can prove it. Yeah. Um, because where it was found. The cold storage warehouse where the body was found. Interrogation implicate Hitomi is an achievement I just got. Excuse me? It's been managed by Renju Okiura for almost two decades now. And witness testimony proves that he knew about the corpse there. And if I kind of want to see what achievements I didn't get. You knew about the corpse too, Hitomi. You and Renju have been close since high school. It's not too much of a stretch to think that he told you about the body. 
And I remember you telling me once. You may have heard phone call again, but I don't know. Let me let me know if you hear it again. And I remember you telling me once. When I was young, I I lost someone very important to me. Monica Ui, my best friend. One of the only friends I had. How did you know that she was dead? Because I can like vaguely hear the phone call I in the didn't. distance, but they're clearly being quieter. Don't than they play were. dumb. I know you're hiding something. Maybe not anymore, but you know what happened here. 18 years ago. And you knew she was pregnant. Preggles. You were her best friend. Of course you would have known. You got her pregnant. Tell me. Tell me everything. Okay. This person's being pretty loud now, but. Okay, yeah, give me a minute. Literally, as soon as I opened the door, they got real quiet again and started pretending like they had been doing it the whole time. Date, she's not going to talk. Sync with her. No, please. This is God. No, I was. I enjoy the puzzle solving of, like, oh, what evidence do I present? I hate Somniums. Dude, we're gonna have to do Date, three Somniums. I'm sure this I've told you enough times by now, but please. Come back within six minutes. I can't promise you that, Pewter. What? What do you mean? I mean, I'm not coming back until I find something. Date, you can't. Yo, infinite time. Why not? You know why. Because it will take over my consciousness? Yes. But if it's only a little. No, not even a little. If the sink passes the. Oops, sorry, my bad. Critical point the damage will be irreparable. But what does that mean exactly? I've accidentally broken open part of my finger. It's not as bad as I just made that sound. We good to go? No. I'm not no. hiding anything. But you are hiding something because we have it. another timeline left. Let's experiment with my mind. Then we'll know for sure what'll happen. Ugh, fine. I'll just say it. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Pewter, tell him. Let's go. You know more about it than I do. Lore, 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 lore. <sighs> boss looks defeated. We beat her. We Ask beat the Peter. boss. We defeated the boss. He knows more about it than I do. Peter! You told me, don't listen to this. Well, first off, six minutes is not a hard limit. But it's the latest safe it limit. Could be seven, or even eight. Okay. I don't care about the exact time. I'm asking what happens if you go beyond the limit. You explode. Do you remember the story I told you about the egg? Genuinely, no. Yeah, why? No, pl actually, please recap it. If you imagine an egg Thank you. as your consciousness, the yolk is what goes into the subject's brain. Okay. The white remains inside your shell. Okay. If you go beyond the limit, your yoke will not be able to return to its shell. Okay. Because the subject's mind will start to take over the sinker's consciousness, right? Okay. I know that part already. Mm hmm Indeed. But there's more to it. What does go back After in After the yoke is devoured, the egg white is brought through the machine next. We couldn't understand this the first huh? time. Yeah, because we needed the bonus info. And there's more. It's not just the sinker's brain. The same process eventually occurs in the subjects as well. In other words, the entire egg ends up being replaced. So we just become her? Mind, consciousness, memory. They are traded. Switched. So I'm her and she's me? Well then, okay, wait, now, but if, okay, if that happens... Couldn't you then just hook up into Somnium again with the same two people for another six minutes and swap them back? The human brain has what can be understood as a memory limit. One brain can only hold one consciousness. Okay. 
And it can only contain one person's memories. You seem quieter than normal. It's a memory swap. Now you know everything. Talk to the boss. That's like w not nearly as bad as I thought the consequences were going to be. I was unaware of this as well. This information is not on any accessible data. Like legitimately, if you told me like I die after six minutes, like that might even be worse than what the actual consequences are. We had to prevent the possibility that the system could be exploited. Exploited? But... Even if it wasn't you, someone else might try. We didn't tell any sinkers this, including you. Yeah, because theoretically, that's like immortality, right? Like, you use it with someone young, and you swap with them. A project Sink is a top-secret project. It's a matter of national security. Even sinkers are on a need-to-know basis. Think about it. What if you were kidnapped by bad people who tried to make you talk? Yeah. Bad people? A criminal organization, spies from another country, those people. If you blabbed about Project Sync, the entire country might be at risk. You heard it from Pewter. The Sync machine isn't just for entering a person's somnium. It can also be used to swap bodies between two people. Okay. Imagine what this machine would be used for in the wrong hands. Okay, so it's more, it's less that there's massive consequences. It's more like we can't allow anyone to do this. That's why I didn't tell you. That makes sense. We can't let this secret get out. It just looks like a face. I get it. I understand. Swapping bodies between two people? So the twist is that... Oh, so the twist for the final one is gonna be that someone else is in Boss's body now? Maybe? You don't You don't have this reveal, and it's not revealed at some point that people have already swapped bodies. Like, you don't... That's the point of this. We're building up to someone has been someone else the whole time. Are you listening to me? Yeah, yeah, I got it. Ding. Are you really Ding. okay? Ding. I'm fine. Start it. Yeah, bro, my fucking finger hurts now that I split part of it open. I've been telling you this the whole fucking time. I don't recall you saying that it lets you swap bodies. Do 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 I feel like we've got two more Somniums. I am the god of fire. I've been saying body jutsu possession. That's not what it is though. That's not the possession is not swapping. Because swapping is like you each get each other. Body possession okay? is just I get yours and mine's empty. That hurt. I'll let you read this porno mag if it'll make you feel better. Yo. I will burn it. But she is the, the god of fire. Is making it pitch black. Is this the mountain? I feel like this is where the mountain's gonna be. Fuck, my finger hurts so much. That's what it is. No, it fucking isn't. The light over there. Is that a firefly? I guess we'll follow the firefly. Somnium scan. Activate. That even lagged my computer a little. Shwink. Shwunk. Shishunk. Alright. Give me like three. That's it. Damn, there's two right here. That's not me, that's Hitomi. I think this is the mountain. I think we are on the mountain Mako was referring to. Reveal the hidden secrets. Reveal Hitomi's secret buried deep inside. Okay. Alright, big thinkies. We're auto walking. It disappeared? No, wait. It might still be nearby. Alright, let's see. Let's solve this. Let's figure it out. Let's use our big thing. We got a flower bud. We've got literally nothing else. So easy peasy. A flower bud. I cannot identify the variety. Uh. 
Yeah, man, let's worship it. Worship it? Yeah. I will pray to it as though I am mourning the dead. Very good. That'll uh, appease it, and it will then point us in the right direction. Let's fucking go. It bloomed a little? I don't know what caused it, but it's better than nothing happening. Look at that. Lit it up. Alright. Oh, wait. There's a path. The big tree. Hole in tree one. A hole in a tree. I may be able to fit inside. Well, damn. That's 100% what you should do. I cannot see anything. I it should have stuck my hand in. Dark. Did you notice anything? I did hear the faint sound of the wind. It must be hollow on the inside. Damn, that's crazy. A hole in a tree. Anyway, hit me with a stick hand in. I am not going to be eaten or anything, right? Come on, let's go. Look at that. Consumed by the darkness. Whoa! It's very strange to me that this, like, has an outcome. Yeah, but, but I feel I like Tackle would not have given us an outcome. Than even before. though ideally it should. What? Is someone there? Hey! Dunks is bonking that the door. Voice is... Oh, we're gonna see the Find murder in the voice woods. Is coming from. We're saving time by cutting corners. Five minutes left, Dante. Hole in tree two. Is it? It is leading here. I think. Is it? Wait. No, it's Renju. Renju Okiura. I'm glad I searched for it. Uh, definitely talk to him. Renju, what are you doing in a place like this? He won't answer. Not in a place like this, at least. No, but Renju he's definitely the one we need to talk to. He looks young, but this is definitely Renju Okiura as he appeared approximately 20 years ago. 20 years ago? That's crazy. That's a long time ago. We're still going? This is not the answer? It's like definitely him though. Renju Hit him. This is for neglecting your responsibility to oh, Mizuki, what a dodge. You coward. No use. I can't This Renju is still a teenager. He wouldn't know Mizuki yet. Renju Dude, is it really not him? Yoo-hoo, Renju. Come get some of this. Come on! Sorry, that was a bad idea. Don't apologize. This is Renju's fault for having bad taste. Damn, they really put Renju here after making him call out, and he wasn't the answer. I understand now why Mako says this is the worst. Hey, look. What? A rock. Yeah, man, this sucks. Mako was right. A hole in the tree. It looks about as big around as a... I am not going to be sucked in, am I? Are you going to pull something out? That's strange. Should have worked. Did you want to see me get sucked in? Yeah. I'm gonna be right back, dude. You ain't gonna miss something. Cause I'm about to get fucking stuck. I'm about to get stuck. A rock. I hit the wrong button. Understood. My foot hurts. I see. My foot hurts. Sorry. So. The banana a rock. is too big. 
But it's hopefully I fall oh, on ice again. In the rocks too, you know. A rather Japanese way of thinking. Just try What's it. That if you insist. How was it? You've cleared your Yes. I now hey, feel a sense of emptiness. We're pulling up a fucking tutorial. I guess it was a waste of time. I do not want to hear that from you. Which one is this? Hey. Three minutes, Date. Hey, which one is this? Let's go back to let's go back to checkpoint one. I'm, I'm looking it up. I don't care. The Tommy Sink walkthrough. I don't give a shit. Fuck you. I'm not about to just sit here and click on random things. Oh yeah, this is definitely the worst one. It's literally called Sinking in the Mountain. Mako was right. Okay. I don't- wait, what's the option here? What's- what's the solution? I can't find the solution. Nobody knows. There it is. Let's see how batshit insane this solution is. This is the wrong one. You've given me the wrong guide. Sinking in the mountain. Is there not a puzzle guide for this? Did this website do a puzzle guide for every one of them but this one? Listen, I'm not even kidding you. This is not a joke. The, the Twinfinite did a walkthrough of every single one of these except for sinking in the mountain every one of them i i'm like i'm this is not a joke i can't find it Okay, a complete guide to every single one of these. Where is, is this it? No, sinking in the vein, sinking in the villain, sinking in the curtain, sinking in the swain, sinking in the main, sinking in the main two, sinking in the sustain, sinking in the mountain. Okay. Rock to- Oh my god, are you kidding me? Listen to this. Listen to this. Rock to- A rock. Worship. Listen to this. Listen to this. Worshipping rock to is not necessary to progress, but you'll need a timey for the very last interaction. Otherwise, you'll run out of time and won't get the Day 5 Hitomi A entry in your album. I was lucky and got one fourth timey on my first try, but you might need to try other interactions to get at least a one third timey before continuing. But it's a rock. Gods live in the rocks. Are too, you, you know. fucking kidding me? A rather Japanese way. Just try it. If you insist. That's how min maxed this has to be. It? You've cleared your head, right? Yes. I now feel a sense of emptiness. I guess it was a waste of time. I do not want Good. Good. 
Now we go to the hole in tree one and stick our hand in. A hole in a tree? I am not going to be eaten or anything. Uh, I can't speed this up, by the way. Whoa! Despite experiencing this already. Fun fact, my mouse was just hovering over the end stream I button. Fell, coincidentally, by placement. Dark, what? I could have accidentally clicked there? a button. And ended the stream. That Find out where that... Okay, so here's where I got stuck. And the answer is... Hole in a tree two. Tackle. Five minutes left, Dante. Hole in tree two. Tackle. I've lost the fireflies. Give me my secret item back. What? A hole in the tree. It looks. Why didn't I what? Understood. I will do my best. Okay, what does that cause? What's the thought process here? This is. Oh, of course, a photo a comes out. Picture of Hitomi, Renju, and Monica. Yeah. Everyone is so young. Hold on to that. Number three. Show picture to ring you. Why didn't you quit? Oh, okay. Because we've come this far. Renju, okay. Renju, look at this. <laughs> oh shit! He said, "I'm out of here." Wait. He said, "Oh no, I've I've Renju, seen this game before." Stop. Shook Renju. I thought that said shoot Renju for a second. Hey, let me make it very clear. I wouldn't solve this in a million years. Looking at some of the stuff I have to do in a minute, I would have never done it. I did never figured it out. Like, even knowing what I need to do, I have no idea where it wants me to go. Four minutes. Like, I don't know where any of this shit is. Hole one. What is this hole? It wasn't here earlier. Jump in. Really? Yeah, go ahead. You have Understood. to find these things. Please, I'm using a guide for this. And I had no idea where this thing was. You have to find these, pick the right option, and even then you have to min-max enough to apparently have a timey ready for the final option. Let's see how close I cut it using a guide and picking only the, like, absolutely necessary uh, options. It's even more difficult to see now. Another voice? Oh, another voice, you say. Monica! That's Hitomi's voice. Where is she? Look for her. Alright. So here is 100%. We're like... Here's where I would have never figured it out. Hole in tree Another three. Hole in a tree. About as big as a capybara, I estimate. Those are pretty big. Scream. Hitomi! I can't see anything. Dante likes Hitomi! Hey, what are you trying to say? Hitomi won't remember this sink. But still. Hitomi, stop. Yeah, that's her as a little schoolgirl. But instead of a school, she's like a young adult. A hole in a tree. And then minutes, you have to stick your hand in after I screaming won't in it. Get sucked in, Don't right? go look for her or anything. Immediately stick your hand in after screaming. A cord bracelet has appeared on my wrist. Perhaps it belongs to someone. Might be important. Hold on to it. Okay, well now this part is just logical. It's Show the bracelet to a Hitomi. Now, you may be asking yourself, as I am, 
where the fuck is Hitome? There she is. What? That's Hitomi. <laughs> Do you remember this? I can't believe this is in a video game. This whole fucking puzzle. Wait. Follow her. On it. Dude, I'm not gonna remember where she went. So here's where it at least follows a pattern, because now she's run off, and now we're gonna do the same thing we did with Rinju, which is we're gonna find hole number two, and we're gonna jump in. Now I'm gonna... Oh, God, the camera. There it is, hole two. At least I found this one a quickly. A large hole. Was... You should jump right on in. If there is nothing left to do... Okay. <laughs> Date, what is going on? I don't know. It's pitch black. I want to make it very clear. Anything. I want to make it very clear here. I see. Then it is not me malfunctioning. With the exception of the rock that I went out of my way to do, we have not received any timings. Can you feel your way around? I can try. I've done minimum walking. You have less than two minutes, Date. Hurry. So... Oh my god, is it a maze now? So we get here. What? How long does it want us to take? Okay, dig up. That's fine. Let's do it. Maybe this guy was wrong about needing the timing, because it looks like there's only one step left. What? Another hole. And with that, we have one minute left. A large hole. Oh! Yeah, okay. Now, I feel like you don't instantly lose, but I'll do it just to be We've safe. Come this far. I will not protest now. I'm pretty sure you're fine if you run out of time on the final option. But I can understand where they would be mistaken about that. I could be mistaken about that. But I think we've done that before. Well, also, there's a Iris Somnium. One of the Minecraft one literally ends with it taking all of your time no matter what. That is... So anyway, that's hell. That's actually the worst one. Mako was right. her dead ass body. Did Hitomi kill her? She gave birth and I was like Maybe Hitomi and Rinju were dating but then she cheated with Rinju and so Hitomi fucking killed her. Oh shit, I just dropped my water. I feel like this was obvious. I feel like we didn't need this absolutely insanely elaborate Somnium. It's a real clean for being in the dirt, yeah man. They very carefully lowered her. I feel like we knew that they were involved with the fucking murder. Like, what's, like, we had, we did the big, Tell me. oops, you slipped up and revealed that you knew she was dead. Why did we need that if we were just gonna go into her memories and find I it? I think I know what happened 18 years ago. I could have just provided the evidence, excuse me. You three were close. You, Monica, and Renju. Monica was murdered. I could have just dang in her own bud and or Phoenix the righted her weapons. into the guilty conviction. And you brought it back to the cold storage warehouse. Oh, they didn't kill her, they found her in the woods. I guess. So Sejima killed Monica. I'm stupid. I've seen inside his head before. Using this machine. I'm fucking dumb as shit. Where'd you I get the baby it. from then? If you know that much, then there's no point in hiding it anymore. I'll tell you the truth. 
So, like, every single person you... This, like, top secret sinking machine. Every single person you do this to, like, finds out about it. Like, because you have to explain to them what you just fucking did. Bro, it's a baby. It's so Sejima's baby. Hey, what's going on? Wait, you're going to see So? Yes. I want to talk to him in person. No, you can't. Why not? Are you yeah. worried about my body? I don't understand. You don't have to worry about that. I'm totally fine. But your stomach is still... Oh, my doctor told me that's normal. Your stomach doesn't go down right away after giving birth. I'm not worried about your body. It's a real small baby. Uh, or Ringe I don't know how to explain big. it. So doesn't care about you. Yeah. And especially not your child. Correct. I haven't told him about giving birth. He contacted me for the first time in a while. So that's why. He wants to know about the baby. He must be panicking. If anyone ever finds out his mistress had his baby, his political career would be over. So So Shijima was killing everyone it's involved. It's not like it was an affair. Is So Iris's dad? Yes. His wife passed away after giving birth to his son, right? It would still be a big scandal. He impregnated a girl who just graduated high school. Don't you see how that looks? <laughs> it was real he knew bad. How the public would take it. That's why he gave you the money to deal with it. Listen, Rinju is correct here. There's no way he'll accept that child. It's okay. I told him that I won't cause any trouble. Yet you're gonna go talk to but him? Could you take care of the baby? Just for a little bit? Oof. I'll be right back. Dog, in what world Fine. would you let her go alone? Ringy we'll take this with you, just in case. Tans are the baby. What is that? A magic it's beam? It's a GPS transmitter. Oh, okay. Just to be extra safe. I really don't think I'll need it. But okay, if it'll make you feel better. You know what? At least that explains why they found the body. Or how they found the body, I should say. I don't know what. What an actually about. strangely logical scene filled with complete idiots. She said he was kind and loyal, that he wanted to change Japan, but I didn't understand any of it. We tried to convince her to break up with him so many times. She never listened, and it ended in tragedy. Was Sosejima that fucking old? Eighteen years ago? What happened next? Why does he look exactly the same? Neither Renju or I saw it happen, so I don't know how much of this is accurate. But we could guess what happened. What if she went there with, like, the... Why did they meet at a cold storage warehouse? She's like, I'm still pregnant. Look at my stomach. Oh, it was an assassin. Wait! Wait, why did he yell for him to stop? What? Wait, why did Sosujima yell to stop? Wait. And why would you know that he yelled to stop? You weren't there. What the fuck? Who told me this? Renju told me. Oh, what? He said he wasn't there. He heard some of this from the Kumakuras. Okay. Renju had connections with them. True, we do know this. How did the Kumakuras know? So told them. But why? <laughs> like, why would So tell anyone? Yeah, man, this is somehow our theory. <laughs> he told her to move overseas. He said he'd pay for everything. Date, you said that Monica was killed by So. Right? <laughs> what? But that's not true. Monica was killed by Saito Sejima. I've heard the Sejima name. The son of So and his late wife. Oh, cause So Sejima, never mind. <laughs> Listen, my brain is fried. My brain is fried. Oh, brain blast. That's my brain right now. The time. Twelve. What? What? But why would a little boy do that? I don't know. I can't imagine. <laughs> Excuse so me? 
contacted his friend, the chairman of the Kumakuras. He asked him to dispose of the body and left the scene with Saito. The incident was 18 years ago. That means the chairman was Rohan, not Moma. Makes sense. Rohan went to the scene of the crime? The original Cyclops killer? Yes, with some of his men. Those were high stab wounds. He was a tall 12 year old. Again, neither. Listen, unironically. No, listen to me. I mean this from the bottom of my heart, right? I mean this legitimately. My, like, cousin, who I. Th he literally. I'm pretty sure is eight years old. I'm. He's. He is 11 at the most, but I'm 99%. I know this is a big age gap. He's 11 at most. I'm 99% sure he's like eight or nine. He's fucking five foot tall. He's he's legit only like a like about a foot smaller than me. Kids these days, brother. Kids these days. But she never came back. We tried to call her cell, but it didn't connect. But then, we saw movement on the GPS. The GPS Renju you gave to Monica? Yep. Yes. At first, we thought she was on her way home. But we saw the GPS getting further and further away from the city. Renju and I got nervous, and we decided to follow it. What about the baby? They are built differently. <laughs> I know, right? They will simply... I've I've got the size advantage on him in terms of my width, but he's... uh, You will smoke me at basketball. We couldn't take the baby with us, so... Renju gave the baby to the mob doctor he trusted. What? <laughs> he fucking mob doctor. Can you, like, watch this fucking baby for me? And the dude's like, what? And then they just like forgot to cover the body and dirt. Man. They will simply <laughs> become a basketball. We didn't dare move. We couldn't speak. We were barely hey, breathing. Hey, Kuma we could only watch as it all unfolded. Hey, Kumakura doctor, can you hold this baby for me? Let's go find the dead body. Oh shit, those are Kumakura men. Oh, damn it. I knew what the hole was for, but I couldn't move. Couldn't do anything. Do they just forget to I cover her up? Heart beating so fast. Man, they just wrote Shoko out of this story. Yeah, I'm like, when did she come in? Is, was Shoko the mob doctor? Before long. Who had to hold we the baby. Here. Yeah. I like that he's an initiate. Cover her. Just a minute. I want her eye. Pop. Ew. That was an unnecessarily realistic noise. Beautiful. That was real loud and echoey. The Kumakura people covered Monica's body. Then let Renju and I ran over and dug up the grave with a tree branch. And then like Rohan kills himself at some point what? for some reason. We saw. And they really did a shit job covering her up. <laughs> You're dirtier than she is! Monica! <laughs> Gamer, I think we solved the case. Monica. No, Shoko's still here. Oh my god. What if Shoko is in the boss's body and the boss was Shoko and dead? We need to. We need to go. Also, why was Rohan the Cyclops no, killer? We can't. Not yet. Why not? You don't know who those guys are. They would do anything to keep this hidden. I've seen it happen myself. Is there like an AI the Somnium Files explained of. video? Anyway, think about it. Why would they do this? Can they we make Monica and her baby were going to be trouble? Can we make Game Theory play this and just watch him have a fucking meltdown trying to come up with imaginary Monica's theories about still this? Pretty big. I don't think they know that she gave birth already. 
What do you think they'd do if they found out? I mean, they'd take her and kill her too. What if they like you, the fucking you gave the baby to the mob and boss, you idiot? They'd come for us. They'd make it look like we disappeared. All of us would be gone. Hey, what's Renju up, guys? What's up, fellow Kumakuras? It's just it's your boy Renju Okira here to pick up my completely uh, unrelated he baby. Knew more about the dirty underbelly of society than anyone. Thanks for watching. He something couldn't be handled by the police. He said that they would do anything to kill the child, and I believed him. We had to protect Monica's baby. We had to, no matter what. Okay, that explains the terrorists that came after her several okay. millennia ago. I understand. I decided to trust him. Wait, didn't you also date a criminal? Like, what about Falco? Was Falco, like, supposed to kill her the whole time? Oh, I guess that would explain why Falco was Monica's supposed to kill her, actually. Forest. We cleaned her up and took her to the cold storage warehouse. Why didn't you just give her a fucking burial? Why did you keep her in a storage warehouse? Let's go check on the body. Every few years, every every month, we go see her. Oh look, she's still fucking dead as shit. Don't like bury this her with a little is cross or something. Fishery. My father runs it, but it's not in use right now. They're moving operations to a better area. They're actually looking for buyers right now. But don't worry, I'll take over the warehouse. Are you sure? Yes, I'll keep everyone out. Everyone but you, of course. What the fuck? I'll give you a key. You can come visit any time you want to see Monica. Yeah, anytime you want to see her fucking eyeless, stabbed corpse. Not like a tiny, like, homemade shrine or anything. Come to the negative 58 degree building to look at your friend's fucking frozen, Monica, lifeless body. Don't worry about the baby. I'll protect her, no matter what. Why did they move the body? Because they didn't want to leave and her in the woods, so they were like, let's go put either. her in a fucking frozen storage warehouse. The people who did this to you? I will never forgive them. Wow, that means a lot. Thanks. I'm sorry, Monica. Sorry. I'm sorry. Monica. 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 Wait, so who was in the polar bear outfit? Was that Sosajima too? But he's like old. Was that a member of the Kuakuras? The mob doctor took care of everything. I have the birth certificate, and I even picked up a mother and baby book. Bro. It wasn't cheap, but you don't have to worry about it. Just submit the birth certificate, and everything will be taken care of. Why'd you get the most expensive mother baby book then? You look worried. I feel like I'm somehow betraying Monica. She was OMG. the one who gave birth. Soon, you won't even be able to think about that, because a war is about to begin. A war? A war? So Sun is the new killer. That's why So acted the way he does. Between you and That me, makes a lot of sense. You won't get a good night's sleep for a long it's, time. It's far from the least insane thing that's happened. In the last two hours. You might even start to resent Monica for all this. Really? Anyway. What a weird fucking thing to say. As soon as you submit the say. certificate, you will officially be her mother. Be sure to raise her responsibly. I'll help. Occasionally. Occasionally, huh? I'll give her a job as an e-girl. I'll make her a titty streamer. I don't really want to discuss this, but... There's something you need to know. Okay. After talking to the Kumakura gang... I found out who killed Monica. Okay. So's son, Saito Sejima. Yeah, thank Mako. We've never seen So's son before to give us any hints. Yeah. Saito was only. I can't wait for Saito to just not be in the game. Twelve years old. Why? Why would a little boy do that? I don't know the motive, but I know it's true. So used his connections with the Kumakuras to cover up for his son, and all of the evidence of this scandal, of course. Oh, so the murder wasn't planned. His kid is just a psychopath. I'll never forgive them. So, his son, or the Kumakuras. And so covers I it up. I feel obviously. the same way. But you can't think about revenge now. 
You and the baby can't lead a life like that. <laughs> Just bear with it for now. The opportunity will come. Oh my god. Frosty. Frosty. What if number 89 is So's son? So wait until the right moment. Okay? <laughs> Fringy, 19 years old. I was thinking about her? her name. How about Iris? Maybe he's like, yeah, Iris. cool. I mean, whatever. You're the, the mom now. Of rainbows in Greek mythology? And the colored part of your eye. <laughs> and the flower, too. <laughs> what? Yeah, and the color, the colored part of your eye. You know, the thing that got ripped out of her dead mom's skull. Right. Do you think Hitomi ever planned I on taking... I thought something to do with your name, Hitomi. <laughs> do you ever think Hitomi planned to take Iris to go see her mom's fucking frozen corpse? <laughs> Not only that. I don't think the ages line it's up. It's also for Monica's name. Bro, the kanji whatever. for Monica uses the character for love. Yeah. And Monica reminds me of Monaco. Japanese for eye. What does the name having to do with love have to do with so this? So both names have something to do with the eye. And I, which means love, will always be a part of Iris. I, the the Somnium files. Okay. So that's how you came up with the name. Okay. Don't you think it's nice? Okay. Iris. I get it. Iris. Yeah. Iris, like this was almost over. And so my life with Iris began. Raising a child was much harder than I expected. Wham. Wham. Waking up in the middle Wham. of the night to change Wham. diapers Wham. or feed her. Iris wasn't a good sleeper. I had to sing her lullabies to put her to sleep. And I always needed to put her to bed so carefully. It would only take ten seconds before she'd start crying again. So I had to pick her up. Sing her another this is what song. Kimmy sounds like when I say I don't like Modica Magica. After doing this over and over, before I knew it, the morning sun would creep in through the windows. But even with all that... Hey gamer, it's probably going to be one more stream. No, we've got one timeline left. We've got one day left. We can do it in the next hour. never went away. But my hands were full, raising Iris. I devoted myself to her. I never thought about anything else. Eventually, my desire for revenge just faded away and then I got shot when they came to kill my boyfriend what what mommy I won race today kids eating fucking omelets before they can talk mommy proud of me no gamer you know it'll take more than an hour absolutely what the fuck is milky moon so good at dancing Mommy, pancakes are done! Sorry, I burned it a little. No, really, I'm burning pancakes. Mommy, why can't I dance at the stores? I can't help it! My body dances on its own! And then Renju is like, Damn, Mommy, your kid grew up looking real fine. Let's make her an e-girl. How come it's always you and me? Hey, Mommy. How long will it take my bone to get better? I want to dance again with everybody. I completely forgot she like broke her leg at some point. Hey, mommy, do you like my shirt? Look, we're matching. Mommy, thank you for everything. I love you more than anything in the whole wide world. What a complete opposite child than Oda. <laughs> mommy, look, I drew it. <laughs> The Okonomiyaki War, huh? That was so fun! We should do it again! No, it was the food a nightmare or the food fight? Um... Oh! I'm gonna have to say no to the latter, sweetie. It took forever to clean. Yeah. But Uncle said he wants to do it again, too! No, you've been beaten by democracy. Hey, Mommy? Yes? Are you gonna marry him? What? What are you talking about? As long as it's Uncle, I'm all for it! I say go for it! I would always question myself. Could I keep living a lie? It's crazy that she has naturally bright pink I'd hair. I promised Monica that I would avenge her. And yet both grew as his vindictive evil people. But yeah. I couldn't work up the courage. And maybe Renju was exaggerating. But there's no And the one who grew up as a shitty child him. would eventually overcome his evilness to like apologize to his mom, but he's still like a simp. 
If we showed Monica's body, and the one who was a good kid, so would be punished by the law. If he was a good kid, and the Sejimas and Kumakura's crimes would be uncovered. Uh, you're like dead. But that would mean Iris's secret would be uncovered as well. That's what I was really worried. How so? About. I didn't want what? Iris to know that So was her father. Also, like you would be implicated in the crime for hiding a body for eighteen years. And even more than that. I didn't want her to know that I'm not her real mother. That's the real reason I've been silent for 18 years. I didn't want to lose Iris, but... Dude, I wish we got to hear all of the fucking news reports. God, other means to take Iris from me. Is she dead in this timeline? I can't remember. No, she's in the hospital. In January. Iris oh right, this is the brain collapsed. tumor timeline. It was caused by a malignant tumor in her brain. There's nothing we can do. She only has a year to live at most. That's what the doctor said. If you remember me telling you. No, I but do. what I didn't tell you is that there was an experimental new treatment. What? It was. Somnium. Some of the cutting edge nanomachines can even go inside your body and cure illnesses. They can even cure cancer. And they I actually beep, beep, beep. vaguely remember That's her awesome. talking about this. At like the start. Nano machines. Nano machines. Nano machines. But the procedure would be so expensive. With my salary, it wasn't something I could afford. I thought hard about it, about how I could get my hands on that kind of money, but I couldn't think of a solution. Time passed. So I blackmailed So Sejima. Before I knew it, it was November. Iris's symptoms worsened. Her time was running out. I was starting to panic. I couldn't sit here and waste time while Iris... In any case, I had to get the money before it was too late. So I thought of a plan. A plan to blackmail Sosajima. That's when you see Sosajima going to the frozen warehouse because he's looking. They're showing him the body. Two days ago, on Saturday night, I called So and invited him to come to the warehouse. He agreed to come. After I hinted at what happened 18 years ago, I had prepared everything, hiding behind the <clears> forklift <throat> until So came. Oh, okay, and that's why uh, when he Date found left. the body laying out, because so she left it out for Sosajima to see. You walked in. He walked over to the workbench where I had laid Monica's body. He lifted the cloth and looked down. <sighs> he whimpered and stumbled back. Even he was phased, seeing a body he thought he got rid of 18 years ago. What a fucking it was crazy a good a plan. He was in a relationship with a woman his own son killed. He reacted exactly as I expected he would. I had prepared a recording and sent it to his phone. To the saw video. I know what happened to each other. It's it is everything. I know who did it, and I know she had a baby inside her. You can probably guess what I'm going to say next. Be prepared to pay for my silence. I will tell you the exact amount later. And don't tell anyone about this. Not Saito. Not the Kumakuras. If you do anything even remotely suspect, I will go to the press with the truth. What the <laughs> he reacted to a Understand? dead body. I told him to keep quiet and cut ties with the Kumakuras. Even if he found out who I was, without the Kumakura gang, he had no power over me. And that's why he was there with him and that one no day. Way he'd risk his political career. Fuck, this makes me. sense. I saw In so just this timeline. pocket and run out of the warehouse. I came out of my hiding place to put Monica's body back. But then, something unexpected happened. What the fuck are you talking about? I'm just gone, brother. Go on without me. I'm a lost soul. I saw you, Date. I hid behind the forklift. Don't you saw don't me. pity me or worry and for me. I'm around. gone. <sighs> it can't be.
They didn't even like bother putting clothes on her. Iris. He can't risk his political career, but his career would be ruined already, so he has nothing to lose. What the fuck are you talking about? He would be outed for murder. For covering up a murder, hiding a body. He would go to jail, and his son would, too. Instead, Iba did the talking. Cool. Iris is not Hitomi's daughter. I get it, yes. We watched but all of this. Iris's father. I'm not letting her. Her mother, Mark. Yes. We know. However, Hitomi... Yes. Hitomi showed unwavering love and compassion for her, just as much as her biological mother would have, if not more. With what proof? Dude, I don't know. Iris's tumor was discovered in January of this year. The only possible treatment was experimental nanotechnology. However, that treatment is restrictively expensive. Hitomi devised a plan to blackmail Sosajima for the money. The hey, best way to establish the blackmail was to show that is why Hitomi created the scene with the corpse. She was the one who called So to the warehouse. On Sunday night, what Date saw was what Hitomi had prepared for So. That is the summary of what we have, but there are some things. Oh, yes, I just sat through all of that. Date. Oh, only some together. things. Ask her questions. Date, snap out of it. Nope, sorry, it's time for the credits to roll. I heard I have a call for me and came too. Why did Rohan remove Monica's I'm eye? Sorry. I have no idea. Continuing some did you tell Rinju about blackmailing? No, I did not. All of this was my idea. Sundays. You probably don't have to ask, but let me just be sure. After I left the warehouse, what did you do? I put Monica's body back under the hood of the forklift. Then I left. Makes sense. Alright, yeah. That's why the police didn't see the body when they arrived on the scene. It makes perfect sense now that I have the facts. Iris did not resurrect. You simply mistook Monica for Iris. Man, the dogs outside are freaking out. The body did not disappear. Hitomi moved it. Those were the events at the warehouse Sunday night. Simple. Simple. There are still a few loose ends, but I believe I understand what occurred 18 years ago. Time to arbitrarily Yeah! Back to yeah! Speaking of which, Her the beginning of the game. Though. Is it connected? Or are these two separate cases? If there is a connection, it would be with Renju and So. Yeah, actually, isn't Shoko the only dead person in this timeline? Think about it later. More importantly... Maybe so, Sujima? I headed for the exit. Yeah, they definitely could have found the body if they looked Wait. harder. Where are you going? To look for Iris, of course. But you have no idea where she is, right? Do you? Do you know something? Yes. Yeah? Where? At around 4 o'clock today. I received a phone call. I don't know who it was. They were using a voice modulator. No, oh, she's with Falco, right. What did they say? I have your daughter. Don't call the police or she dies. That's why I didn't tell you earlier. Renju. We don't know that for certain. It's it fucking... could be number yeah. 89. Either way, Iris is in danger right now. There might have to the be another stream. The voice asked for something else. He told me to go to a specified location with you. With me? Yes. The culprit knows me? It must be Renju. Hmm. What location? I'm sorry, but this oh, stops now. I forgot about this. Right, you worked with Falco. We did. Oh, she's been shot. Okay. Date. Run. Pull him. Boss. Boos. Do 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 do. Please do not worry. I merely put her to sleep. What were you <laughs> doing? Remember, he, this is the timeline where he helped My Falco orders. escape. They told us to halt our investigation. 
The boss was already going against orders as it is, which is why... Investigation? What investigation? Shoko or Iris? Neither. The investigation of Monica's murder. Monica? That's not what we're investigating. But her case has all but completely solved. Yes, but only to us, right? If we ah, say I nothing, see. then her investigation is ongoing. So Sejima, so threatened us, didn't he? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. That's us. That's us watching the whole game. I did say watch instead of playing, and I meant it. As of five minutes ago. In fact, you are to be placed under house arrest. <laughs> what will you do, Date? I suggest you comply. Kill. Iba, can you turn the power off? Easily. All right, get ready. Three, two, one. You fucking idiot. Oh, God. I don't know, so I shot the boss. It's okay, he shot her with a sleepy bullet. Now tell me, where is she? She's just sleeping. I can't tell you. Why not? If I told you, you'd go alone, wouldn't you? Oh, but okay. if I don't go with you. All right, take Fair me there. Enough. This fucking sucks. Yeah, this whole game, brother. Don't hydroplane. Oh, dunks. Oh, dunks. It's a crazy day. Oh, you're fat. Big I tummy. Know this place. It's the chemical plant that closed eight years ago. Whoa. I knew that. How did I know that? Wasn't it like the murders in one of the somniums or something? Date, I'm sorry, but this is going to be bad. What happened? Someone has begun to access my stored memory. Oh no! They are attempting to wipe all the data. Uh oh. Everything I have accumulated over the last five years. Uh oh. Including backup. <laughs> Is Pewter doing this? Almost definitely. Pewter, we should have killed him. How'd he get out of the locker? I summoned some ice, but that will only buy time. I have four hours at the most. After my ice is broken, Pewter will be able to access Wadget, my core programming. He would be able to destroy my mind. Why? It must Ruh -ruh. be related to the orders they are receiving from the top. The higher ups clearly see you as a threat, Dante. They are attempting to limit your power by removing me from the equation. I suppose their motivation hardly matters. <laughs> How did he get out? The most important thing exactly. now is finding Iris and bringing her to Abyss within four hours, or else. Dude, let's do it within ten minutes. Date, what's wrong? Nothing. Just. All right. Now you know. So get moving. I'm counting on you, Date. Four hours. It's fine. That should be plenty of time. I grip my revolver and got moving. So I start blasting. I'll go in first. You wait here. Okay. Housekeeping. Four more hours. Knock knock. Oh fuck. Is that? Damn. Renju? Oh right! It was the freaking- it was the fake one that requires your eye being removed. That's where I got that idea from. Not the fake one, the prototype that requires your eye being removed. Oh, that was it. We're in it, boys. <laughs> We're in it. <laughs> hey, uh, I believe you fucking suck. What? Yeah, there's unfortunately one more stream of this. We have to go through 
a whole, unironically, unironically, if I didn't need to go to the store, I would fucking force through it. But it took an hour longer to get my food than I thought. Which might cost us finishing it today. More jumping back and forth. Ah! Hey gamer, hey. Let me keep it 5G with you. We got three options. We can finish this Tuesday. We could finish it tomorrow. Or I could run to the store, come back in like 30 minutes, and we finish it. I will leave that entirely up to you. In which case, I'm going to I'm gonna blow my nose while you decide, while you think about it. And this is where the YouTube version will end off. You want to build more? So here's the thing. Here's the thing. Uh, the only reason that I even said tomorrow is an option. Because if we do it Tuesday, we'll just do uh, three games, three hours tomorrow, which is fine. If we did it tomorrow, we could start Ben 10 Tuesday and start getting that out of the way. I'm going to cheat and see how many Somniums are left. Fuck, I think there's like three left. Maybe, if they're all in like order. If this guide is in order, there's three left. So you want it do you still want it Tuesday and a three games, three hours tomorrow, or do you want it tomorrow with Benton starting Tuesday? Big rubs for Dunker. I guess I should save the, and quit the game. How do I, how do I do that from here? I guess I can't. I guess I, I. I guess I have to actually force close the game. You say Tuesday. All right. No, you know what? This isn't what I want. You know what? No, I'm force closing the game. Cause I wanted to read the case file, but I wasn't thinking about it. It started Tuesday. It will end Tuesday, and that's fair. All right, tomorrow's three game, three hours. I'll throw up the poll here in a bit. So, hey, thanks for coming. It's hell, but we're we're getting to the end. Um, let me see real quick. What's the what's the how long to beat on Benton Protector of Earth? I think it's like eight or it's like I think it's like ten hours. Oh, never! Oh, dude, never mind. Wait, hold up. I'm like on drugs because how long to beat says five hours max. Six hours for completionists.
Should Ben 10 just be a like a singular stream? <laughs> should Ben 10 like should I just get up early Tuesday and Ben 10 is just an an all day not all day but like we just beat Ben 10 in a single stream. And then that gives us like Bim Tim Bem 10. So we finish Aeon the 19th. We start, we would do all of Ben 10 on the 26th. MH Rise release date, March 26th, 2021. So there would be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight Tuesday streams before the release of Monster Hunter Rise. That's a Twitter Discord question. Completely fair. We could we could probably squeeze in another game in eight streams. It, we would have to be like lenient, like not yeah. We 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 uh, we we couldn't just pick something like we couldn't pick a twenty hour game. I mean, factually, we could, but I don't think it would be smart to do so. I guess if it was a good 20-hour game, we would get it done in eight weeks, but there's always a chance of missing a Tuesday, so it's better to play it safe. But, um... That's a conversation that can be had during the Ben 10 playthrough, to be honest. We could literally spend the Ben 10 playthrough talking about what other games we would rather be playing... Uh, yeah, all right, I'll throw up the three games through our poll in a bit, and I'll ask the question. Just remind me to ask that question about Ben 10 when we finish AI the Song and Files. Anyway, thanks for coming. That's going to be it. Uh, sorry it didn't end today. It'll end Tuesday. Thanks for coming.